This selective targeting is more than coincidence. It's strategy. It shows that birds not only recognize us, but also make judgments based on what they remember. They know who to trust, who to avoid, and who to exploit. In some cultures, this ability has been noticed for centuries. Indigenous peoples have long respected crows and ravens as intelligent beings, capable of remembering and responding to humans individually. Folklore often portrays these birds as messengers or tricksters, a reflection of their real-world intelligence. What modern science is proving today is something people have suspected for thousands of years, that birds are far more perceptive than we give them credit for. But the story doesn't end with crows, magpies, or pigeons. Even chickens, often thought of as simple farm animals, can recognize and remember human faces. Farmers have reported chickens responding differently to different people, even showing preference for those who feed them. This means facial recognition is not just a rare skill it's widespread across bird species. Could it be that nearly every bird we encounter sees us as unique individuals, not faceless beings? The implications of this are staggering. If birds recognize us, remember us, and pass that knowledge along, then our relationship with them is far deeper than we've realized. Every action, good or bad, creates a ripple in their memory and behavior, or part of their world in ways we rarely consider. And as we continue to expand into their habitats, the importance of this recognition only grows. They're not just adapting to us, they're keeping score. So the next time you walk past a crow, pigeon, or magpie, ask yourself, what do they remember about you? Did you once feed them a scrap of bread?